Hello and welcome to the 10 Steps to E-Commerce Success, a series of how-to videos to help you start and grow your business online. I'm Emma Jones, founder of Enterprise Nation, the home business website, and this series is sponsored by PayPal. In this episode, Enterprise Nation community manager and tech expert, San Sharma, takes us through a tutorial on how you can create a website in less than five minutes with full e-commerce capability. Ready? Set, let's go. The 10 Steps to E-Commerce Success is produced by Enterprise Nation in association with PayPal. Hello, I'm San Sharma and I'm gonna show you just how easy it is to build an online shop with Mr. Site and with PayPal. In fact, it's so easy, we're gonna do the whole thing in five minutes or less. So set your watches and off we go. So let's start by taking a quick look at Mr. Site at www.mrsite.co.uk and uh, you can see the three packages here. At, at the time of filming they range from £20 up to £100. Um, all of them include a .com or a .co.uk domain name and of course e-commerce features. Today I'm going to use the Pro package uh, which has more advanced features like stock control, postage variations, and full order history. But you can get a basic online shop up and running with the beginner package. Anyway, once you've bought the takeaway website and chosen your domain name, Mr. Site will email you an account ID and password. Then you can log in at www.mrsite.co.uk forward slash create, if I can spell it. Okay, and you might see a uh, Mr. Site browser check. Now, this is just to make sure that you're running an up-to-date browser like Firefox. But if there are any problems, Mr. Site gives you pretty clear instructions on how to fix them. So let's log right on in with the uh, with the user details Mr. Site just sent across. And mine were, if I can remember, yep, and the password, and click log in. And once we're in, you can see that there's a pretty straightforward six-step process here to building a website. So let's start in a logical place with step one and pick a design for the site. As you can see, there's, there's quite a few templates, but I quite like the look of this one here, Critters. So if I click on it, it should pull up a preview. And if we like what we see, we can click Select This Design. Now you get an opportunity here to personalize it a little bit, but there are lots more options later on. So just for now, we're going to click save and finish. And then moving along the menu to number two, this is where we get to tell Mr. Site how many pages we want in our website. Now we can add or remove pages later on. So I'm just going to say five for now. So we've got room for an about us page, uh, a contact us page, and of course the shop. And then we get to give the site a name. I'm calling it Sand Sweet Shop and save changes. Okay, great. Now, now we have a few pages. We can change. Uh, we change some content. So let's do that. Step three. Okay, and you pick the page you want to change. I'm going to change the, f the first page and make a welcome page. So you've got three boxes here. Um, it's asking for a title, so I'm going to put welcome. A short description here, so welcome to Sans Sweet Shop, and the sort of main body of the website, of the web page. Sorry, um, the only place to buy sweets online. Well, actually, it's not the only place, is it? Not the only place, but probably the best. Okay. Okay. And actually you can see here that there are, um, we're in simple mode here, which is just sort of plain text. We can actually change to creative mode. And there's a warning here because I'm on a Mac, but it's fine to just press OK. And you can see some more buttons and toolbars. It looks a bit more like Microsoft Word or something. But let's just leave that for now and click Save and Finish. Congratulations, thank you. Changes have been saved. And now let's let's go about setting up this uh, this online shop. So we won't publish the site yet, that's step four. Let's go to step five, which is extras, which is where we'll find under add features. 
add edit a shop this is what we want so we click here and let's get going now you need a PayPal account to build an online shop with Mr. Site and you can set one up at paypal.com and once you have you can just enter your PayPal email address in this box here's mine and then tell Mr. Site how many products you'd like to add to the shop but let's just do one for now and then you can choose um, on, on which page you want the web the, the shop to appear so I'm going to pick page 2 and the currency here that's fine pretty easy so far um, so this would be a list of the products and we've only got one because we only chose to add one uh, at this stage click edit item to add a title I'm going to put gobstoppers uh, a price two pounds and a description uh, these will keep you quiet and then we've got some advanced item options here this tab here uh, where we can for example can the customer buy more than one of this item yes please check that uh, we can also add images for this product so I, here's one I saved earlier Stoppers. and then at these tops, tabs at the top rather, you can click um, and change the layout from classic to contemporary let's go with that uh, change the item arrangement so we can have the most recent items listed at the top and then even more advanced um, we can use PayPal Express which gives us more features like advanced postage options and stuff but let's leave that for now we can come back and do this later and get to sh save shop and continue. You can see it's uploading some files now. Congratulations, thank you very much. I think we're nearly done. So now we've we've done uh, we've added a page, we've added a shop. We just need to go back to step four and publish the site. So this will put it online on the web for everyone to see. And here, Mr. Site is uploading the site, and it's he's done it in a record two point six eight seven five seconds. Shall we have a look? Click here to have a look at our website. Sounds sweet shop. Here's the introduction I wrote. A raft of empty pages I need to come back to. But here's my online shop. Look at that. Amazing. <laughs> the gobstoppers. And you can buy buy them here. Add them to the cart. Which opens a new window to PayPal. Um, which is any, the easiest way probably to, to accept credit card payments on your website. And there you go. You can proceed to check out. Or the customer can rather or continue shopping which takes you back to the website pretty cool amazing we've still got time to do something else probably eat some sweets if anything uh, if you're going to give this a go you can get started at mrsite.co.uk and you'll need a paypal account which you can get at paypal.com uh, i'm san sharma and i'm now a sweet shop owner i guess thank you for watching and good luck with your online shop thanks san and there you have it a website in less than five minutes to find out more about how to start and grow your business online, visit enterprisenation.com, paypal.co.uk or email learnmore at paypal.com. The 10 Steps to E-Commerce Success is produced by Enterprise Nation in association with PayPal.